What's up guys, the Legendary Zero Bloodline here once again and very excited to finally be doing something I always wanted to do. Most people know I love the Devil May Cry series, my favorite being Devil May Cry 3, which most people consider the best of the series. Anyway. What really made me fall in love with this game though was one specific weapon, the Nether. Some of you know I'm a musician, I love music, I love playing music, I love performing, so for a guitar to pop up in a game like Devil May Cry as a weapon, it's just, it was amazing. And to top it all off, it's actually a pretty decent weapon with good versatility and pretty powerful. So after years, I joked to all my friends that the Nevin was so badass that I could beat the entire game with just the Nevin and the shotgun. And I think the shotgun's really good at it too. Well, I finally not only have the means to test that theory, but to prove it to all of you. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna give this a shot and see how things go. I'm, okay, I'm not doing multiple takes, I'm not going to be playing any missions unless I die. If I'm awesome, you guys are going to see it. If I royally fail, you guys are going to see that too. So here we go, time to see just how good me and my favorite guitar really are. Alright folks, here we go. Let's see if I can actually pull this off. Pretty sure I can. I mean, it's only the most badass weapon ever. Better than I expected. Oh, missed. Just a real way to kill. Oh, oh, I love that move so much. Oh, that didn't go too bad, now did it? Okay, yeah, we're skipping the cutscenes. I assume you've seen the cutscenes. If you haven't seen the cutscenes, just go play the games. And we do. Eh. Took a little longer than I wanted, but whatever. Eh, moving on. Now we get to the fun part. The first actual boss. Quotations. Again, let's give it a cut down the time. Assume you've already seen them, but I'm gonna watch them yourself. This is me how the enemies just walk into the giant tornado of rolling electricity and bats and stuff. Turn around, Doctor. Turn around. One thing I have noticed, I'm playing the PlayStation 3 um, HD collection version, I've noticed I have a lot more control issues. I don't know if it's just 
me or the game or what? I don't remember ever having these problems on the PS2. Before. There's nothing about you crippled. It's just sometimes Dante takes a little while to turn around. Probably just me. Yeah, ooh. And I suffered my first big hit. I'm gonna try doing this without Devil Tripper, just because. Did bats kill him? Bats kill him! Far quicker than the shotgun. Bats can get to him. Oh, look, we're already to the hill car. Or the Vanguard, whatever that thing's called. I'm horrible with names. I'm not even gonna try and start naming this stuff. Ah. And you're dead. Yeah. It could have gone a lot worse. Mm -hmm. So, not very fitting of a Devil May Cry God. If I do nearly boost a little. Yeah, see that damage? That was bad. Ah! The bee. Ah, it breaks my heart. But, whatever. Moving on. Yeah, I'm skipping all the silly skipping all the silly cutscenes. Oh, how I hate these enemies, especially in the higher difficulties. That one. Yeah, it's more like it. Another problem is going to be having those in having the PlayStation 2 version. 
Because I accidentally clicked the last step, which changes the target. That doesn't mean no big deal, I'm just I'm gonna kill everything anyway. Makes doing stuff like this. Oh, that way. Again, that could have gone a lot better. Time to fuel up on some red hearts. Red hearts, and red orbs. Yeah, whatever. I just woke up. You guys should appreciate my dedication. I'll wake up, roll out of bed, start playing Devil May Cry. That's how every great day should start. That was annoying. Didn't really think about that. But, since I'm only using the Nevin, I'm only using the Nevin. And a shotgun. Just because. Always love this part, because you think you're, oh no, you're gonna get me. Oh no, you're gonna get me. What am I gonna do? Oh no, I'm gonna dodge and I'm gonna kill you. Or we can just be denied. This is definitely taking some getting used to. I'm having a hell of a time doing it. Killing everything like a rock star. Honestly, I don't know why I'm getting all these red orbs. Typically, don't use items unless it's a last resort. It's more so an OCD thing, just having to collect everything. Uh, this is the one boss fight I actually am looking forward to because I have the two best weapons for taking out Cerberus. It surprised me how much damage the Nevin did the first time I tried it. 
shouting in the way for clearing off the ice. My body's great for taking this, apparently. And that side just wrecks the Okay, let's forget how to dodge the I'm really curious, I see. It doesn't do any. There's no vertical for work. That's this. That's alright. That's the beauty of the side. You can hit all three heads and switch the move and take them all out. And yeah, you're dead. Eh, that's not the best that fight's ever gone for me, but I'll take it. Alright, how do we do? Ow. Another B. I'm gonna start stepping on my game, but for now, I think this is a great place to stop. If you guys enjoyed this, we're gonna keep this going for as long as I can. We'll try and beat the damn game. I'll check you guys later.